Hey everyone, it's the Viperion here and welcome back to the channel for another Crash Team Racing video. This video will be focusing on how to do a perfect U-turn while using the analog stick. If you're familiar with U-turning, I'm sure that you're aware that the analog stick can be a pain in the ass, especially since you have to hit your left analog stick in the exact point on the bottom right side, which is extremely difficult to do and not reliable at all. However, with this method that you're about to see, using the analog stick to U-turn will be a much better, easier and comfortable experience for you. Before we begin, here's a few things you need to know first. Do note that this method requires you to play on the PS4. It will work on the Xbox and Nintendo Switch, but only if it has the exact feature that I'm about to show you. Now I personally don't play CTR on the Xbox and Nintendo Switch, so you just have to check it out yourself if you're on those two consoles. Secondly, this method is for those who are only open to using the analog sticks to play CTR because I know that some people just can't get used to the D-pad because they feel that it's really uncomfortable. If you're that type of person, this method is perfect for you. Thirdly, this method will require you to head into your console settings and tweak a few things. Don't worry as it won't be that hard but it can be a little bit annoying for some people. And finally, I want to mention that I've actually learned this method from a Mexican YouTuber named Press Start. He makes CTR contents as well and his video actually helped me out on this one. YouTube is actually a really really hard place to grow right now especially if you're new. So if you're looking to actually support some other Crash content creators besides me, do subscribe to Press Start as I think he deserves some recognition for his work. Alright now with that out of the way, let's start. Now first of all, you're going to have to head into your PS4 settings. Do this by going to the home screen and navigate to the settings first. After that, you have to select the accessibility tabs. This will open a wide variety of options, scroll all the way down and select the button assignments. Once you're in, select the enable custom button assignments. A new option should pop out, so that's where you need to go next. Now all you need to change is just one button which is the down arrow key. Remap the button to any button that you like. In this case, I highly, highly suggest to remap it to the L2 button because I feel that's the most comfortable button to press for this method. If done correctly, you should see the L2 and the down key is now swapped. Press confirm and now you're ready to U-turn with the analog stick. Once you're in-game and you're ready to do a U-turn, all you need to do now is to simply hold the L2 first, then the handbrake button which is square, and then just tilt your analog stick to whichever direction you want to U-turn into. For U-turning on the ground, press the exact same thing on the controller and simply spam the jump key. Also, if you're wondering on how to swap camera views, just press the down arrow key. So just in case you want to play another game besides CTR, just disable this option and you'll get your old controls back. So that's pretty much the simplest method that I can give you. I know that this might be tedious for some people, but since Crash Team Racing doesn't allow us to change our own buttons yet in-game, changing it in the PS4 settings is the only way for now. For the Xbox and Nintendo Switch, if you have the options to remap your buttons, this can work for you guys as well. So that's pretty much it for this video actually, it's a pretty short one but I'm sure some people will find this useful for them. If you have more questions and just want a place to hang out with other Crash Team Racing players, you can head over to my Discord server to join other Crash Team Racing players such as yourself as well. It's a fun and thriving community that's growing each day, so I hope to see you there. I'll put the invitation link to the comment section down below. Thank you very much for spending your time in watching my videos. Good luck to all racers out there, and I'll see you in the next video.